We're so close. Let's go. Who's it gonna be? Reload it, reload it, reload it. Check it again. Oh Good morning, everybody. It's Max and Kim. We're on the train from Karangasan to Propoli. We did have a pretty early morning. We got up at 4 to leave our Airbnb at 4.30. We caught the train at 5.15 a.m. So it's currently 6.55 in the morning and we are probably a third of the way to Propoli. We did our eating yesterday, so we're still quite sleepy and we're doing promo tomorrow. So it's going to be a couple of days of we don't know what's left. So now we just got to find our Airbnb host. He's waiting for us at the exit, hopefully, and then we can check into our new Airbnb. How are you? I'm Max, nice to meet you. Hello. So this is our Airbnb here. Really simple, really easy. Got the bed, little desk here, do some editing. We've even got a TV. This place is luxury. We have a real toilet today. I hope you enjoyed us showing you around the trains and how they work in Java. Because we took the economy class today, I think what we'll do later in the week, it's not too expensive to get the executive, the first class equivalent of the tickets on the trains. We might see if we can get that later in the week when we go to Jogjakarta, and then we can do a video on that and to do a comparison basically between the classes and what you get for your money in each place. But all in all, trip was really good with the trains today. Not really any issues, it was pretty quick. Yeah, super easy, aircon was real nice. It is a little bit cold, so if you get cold easily, make sure you wear long pants and maybe a jumper. Um, the hot chocolates were amazing and they do sell food and snacks, which we didn't try because our lovely Airbnb host gave us food, but maybe we'll try that on the next one. Two hours later. The water is like, 30 degrees, I'm not even kidding. It's like I'm having a bath. It's like being in a spa. <laughs> no! No! Yeah, I'm like, no way! So nice, and we're gonna take that boat over there to that little house. Maybe we'll go swimming in the warm water. It's honestly though, like a warm bath. It's like hot water beach. Which makes sense, I guess. I don't know how it works, but it is so warm, and the further we're going out, 
And it's not actually an island. It's a mountain of coal. Or the power plant. That they use to feed the power plant. The biggest power plant in Indonesia. And they get all their coal from Kalimantan, which gets shipped over on these islands. Not islands, <laughs> boats. And the coal goes from Kalimantan to the boat, and then they take them from the boat to the power plant. And the power plant supplies all of Java and all of Mali. And because they heat up all the coal for the power, that's why the water is so warm. Alright all right, guys, guys, that, that is, is the vlog. Bit of a short one today. Make sure you tune in next time because we're going up Mount Bromo in the morning and then after that we're going to visit Tumpak Siwu waterfalls. A that thousand waterfalls. One thousand. If you like this video make sure you click subscribe and leave a like down below as well. Other than that stay safe. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. We're so close. Let's go. Who's it gonna be? Reload it, reload it, reload it. Check it again. Lot of people, it wouldn't seem like a lot, but to us, it means the world. The fact that this many people watch our crazy adventures, it genuinely means the world to us. So, thank you so much for being a part of this journey. Thank you to every single one of you, whether it's been from the start or you were number a thousand. We appreciate every single one. If you haven't subscribed yet, are you good, bro? Join us on the journey to 10,000 and let's crush it. Let's do it.